With the 225th pick in the 2022 NFL Draft, the Pittsburgh Steelers select Mark Robinson, linebacker, Old Miss. We brought him in for a visit. Uh, I spent a lot, of, a lot of time with him. He was a running back for most of his career. One year at linebacker at Ole Miss, and he showed speed, he showed athleticism, he showed toughness, physicality, a lot of things we liked. He's a fun guy to watch on film for sure. Take me through your pre-draft visit and just your first experience of Pittsburgh. It was it was pretty neat getting the chance to come out here, just getting out the plane. And what was crazy on my visit, it, they had me like in the city in the hotel, so I wasn't really back here. So, you know, uh, like now that I'm back here all the time, like it's almost a different view to sun be out, we be practicing and stuff. So, you know, it, it was different, like pre-draft. I didn't think it would be like this, but it's been fun so far. So what's something that surprises you or something you've learned about this area? Uh, what surprised me is how hot it was. Yeah, I packed a lot of jogging pants and <laughs> jackets, and but it was so hot out there like the first couple of days. And then it rained. And I thought it was going to be cold, but it was warm again. So I kind of like it. I guess I'm just bringing that uh, down south energy. Yeah. You know, the sun a lot. It doesn't snow here all the time, so that's a good thing. Um, what is it like working with the rookie class, getting a chance to meet veterans and really start the process of, hey, you're in the NFL now? Uh, I mean, for me, it's just uh, eye opening. Learn how to be a professional. Try to uh, see the things they do to take care of their body, longevity, you know, uh, how they study their plays and take notes. And it's a big transition, so, you know, uh, hanging around the older guys, it'll help you a lot so you understand the difference between college and being a professional athlete. Who's someone you're leaning on that's a veteran? Miles Jack, I just kind of like, just watch him and, you know, Minka, I just watch those guys and Najee. And, and you know, uh, Cam, just watching them, not so much just verbally speaking to them, but just watching the way they move and the way they handle business. And, you know, they might not even know it, but I'm definitely paying attention. Those are good guys to pay attention to. Um, so do coaches want you to mainly work inside? And what are they telling you? I know um, TA had said, you know, a little bit about adding some body weight to you. You know, for me, it's just getting in the playbook, learning the stuff, being comfortable, getting ready to play. like getting ready to, you know, just working hard every day to be, be the player that they need me to be, whatever that is, whether it's inside, outside. But yeah, I've been uh, working on the inside position, you know, just trying to learn all the ins and outs, different terminology and um, how we like to do things around here. So that's been fun. And, you know, I'm getting the hang of it. I'm looking forward to it. In terms of the running back, you know, the, the transition from a different side of the ball, how does that help you in terms of playing linebacker? Yeah, that's crazy. I, I knew that one was coming. Everybody asked me that one. <laughs> well, it, you know, they're very different, but they probably are helpful in a way. Yes, ma'am. They are. Um, I think for me, I was trying to like really be like a running back, a Hall of Fame running back. <laughs> so I used to uh, study a lot of stuff at, from the offensive side of the ball. So coming over the defense, just understanding the way that running backs thinks and, you know, what they're looking for and things they see and their thought process. It helps me a lot, you know, sometimes give me keys that other guys may not be able to pick up on. So, you know, just keep learning and try to dwell on those things and add to the package. I'm sure it's kind of a whirlwind for you still, uh, you know, finding out where you're moving to and starting practices and meetings and whatnot. But training camp's, you know, almost a few months away, we could say that. What's one thing you want to accomplish or do before you even get to that point of your rookie season? It's just, uh, it's a day-to-day -day, like routine. Just uh, looking forward to establishing a daily routine as a professional athlete, like whether that be um, early morning workouts, rehab all day, different type of diets and nutritionists and just learn how to be a better me so that whenever the time do come that I'm way better than what they thought I would be. That's the goal.